been accused of some terrible crimes. Of murder, imprisonment, using owls for evil means. Do you have anything to say for yourself? I have nothing to say to you, you worm. Unless, of course, you like them fiddlywigs. Then, then we might talk. There'll be no tiddly winking here today, okay? Now, I'd like to know what happened to Stella's parents. Dead, 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 as dead can be. But it is nothing, nothing to do with me or Wagner. I don't believe a word of it. I really, I don't believe it. you for further questioning, Aunt Agatha, also known as Awful Auntie, and the Owl too. <laughs> There have been a number of reports of strange happenings in the area. These include multiple bat sightings, a number of missing neighbours, the lack of any kind of garlic bread to be found in the area, and I love a nibble on a bit of garlic bread. Can you explain any of this? Well, I'm sure that you will find that there are many bats around at this time of year. Many of my neighbours are on their holidays and garlic bread has been removed to, to its full stench. All explain. May I go now? Um, I, I, yeah, yeah, I suppose you can. Yeah, it, it's all circumstantial. Absolutely. Ex excellent. Plenty of time to get a bite to drink. <laughs> DCI Wingard, and you've been brought in today accused of a number of offences, most of which, the most serious I would suggest, is not bathing ever. What do you have to say about that? I'm missing bags of sticks for this. Yeah, right, we're all missing something, we're all missing something. Evidence would suggest that you bought meat from Billy William III's butcher's shop and then you covered it in poison to feed to Jake the dog. What do you say about that? Yeah, dear busy one, me! It was that awful Friday bloke and that hideous little girl, Polly! It was them, I'm telling you, I want her. Pull the other one, alright? I would suggest purchasing lemonade powder from a Mrs. Lovely on the day on question. Do you remember that? Ah, oh, shabber me whiskers. I'm caught. I do believe you are. You're a bad, bad man, Mr. Gum. Ah. It's off to the cells with you. Oh, get off me, you old gobbler! I'm not coming anywhere with you! Hi, oh, It's cold in here. So, madam, you've been arrested on suspicion of turning people and creatures into stone. And also, making it always winter and never Christmas. What have you got to say about that? Would you like some Turkish delight? Oh, no, 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 thank you. I'm not a jelly baby man myself. What a pity. Have you got anything to say about turning people into stone? No son of Adam or daughter of Eve will take my throne, ever. Is I it think, a war you want? I think you need to calm down. God, I could do with a nice cup of tea 
and a big woolly jumper, freezing in you. Jadis, the white witch, rightful queen of Narnia! I've had a gut full of this for one day. Is it time to go home yet? So, sir, you are accused of being a master of disguise. And probably most regrettably, committing multiple murders. Have you got anything to tell me? I warned those orphans, no matter where you go, no matter what you do, I will find you. Even if this means committing murders? That is very unfortunate indeed. Sooner or later, everyone's story has an unfortunate event or two. Don't you think, officer? Uh, well, I don't know about that. Bit? Well, particularly not for a Monday morning, anyway. Just far too much to think about. <laughs> Count Olaf, I think it's time for you to go back to your cell. Nothing's going right for me today. I'm beginning to think that washing my face was a complete waste of time. a bit unusual. <clears throat> do you want a glass of water? Because I could do with one. It's very smoky in you. Yeah? <laughs> right, um, I'll just get on with it then. You're accused of hoarding treasure and destroying Lake Town. Do you have anything to say for yourself? I kill where I wish and none dare resist. Yeah, yeah, you oh, calm down, all right? Calm down. Is there anything you'd like to say in your defence? My teeth are swords, my claws spears, the shock of my tail a thunderbolt, my wings a hurricane, and my breath death. It's getting very warm in here. This is, this is obviously not going anywhere. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to cut off this interview right now. Do not dismiss me, fool. I am Smaug, the king under the mountain. Right, if you carry on like that, you're going to set us all on fire. So just calm down. Calm down! Well, um, I'm not sure which one to look at, but I will tell you, you were here because you've been accused of throwing your head at people and scaring people to death. People have been disappearing when you call their name. Do you have anything to say about that? This I wing guard. This I wing guard. <laughs> You're not going to frighten me. <laughs> All right. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Beware. 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 Now pick up your head and get out of here. I've had quite enough for one day. <laughs> Hello madam. I need to talk to you about the theft of some puppies. Might you know anything about that? Ha 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 ha! You idiots! You fools! Oh you imbeciles! Might I compliment you on that fur you're wearing? Can you tell me anything about that? Ha ha, my own two love dying, I learnt live for this. But it's not real, of course. D 
darling, if I knew it was cold, I'd have stolen two more and made mittens. Miss Cruella de Vil, I am arresting you right now. I don't believe there's a shadow of a doubt that you are guilty. <laughs> I was born bad and a little bit mad. Look who it isn't. You've been brought in on a catalogue of offences. What have you got to say for yourself? All the better to eat you up with. Ah. <laughs> well, you have been accused of eating people. What have you got to say about that? I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. You can huff, you can puff all you like. But we have reason to believe that you recently burned your bottom. Now, get up, bend over, and show us the incriminating behind. Ow! Caught red bottom, me old frappery bit. Caught red bottom. <laughs> charged with the most terrible offence of burglary. Burglary of Christmas! It's a I'm green, isn't it? Uh, I've heard it all before. I'm green. I'm two years old. No, 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 no. It's because you've been seen stuffing Christmas trees and presents in a sack and thrusting them up chimneys. Frosted. Mr. Grinch, it's to the cells with you. Who to you and the who's to? Madam, you are here because you have been witness shooting laser beams from your eyes and frying another woman to death. Fair old witch, a stupid witch who answers back must burn until her bones turn black. So, uh, no remorse whatsoever. Your other offence is creating a potion to turn all children in the world into mice. Is there anything you want to tell us about that? Down with children. Do them in, boil their bones and fry their skin. Right, that's quite enough of that. I've had a gutful. It's back to the cell with you. Enough! Enough! <laughs> oh, 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 oh. A foolish plot without a brain must sizzle into fire and flame. What? You have been arrested for being one of the foulest creatures that walks the earth. You're accused of sucking away all good feelings and happy memories. What do you have to say for yourself? I didn't catch that. Come again? Right, right. I tell you what, you've been witnessed kissing someone on the lips no less. You were making a sucking sound and afterwards said person was dead. What do you say about that? <laughs> listen, listen, right? We're not getting anywhere. You're not willing to talk to me. This place stinks. I'm going out for some fresh air. This interview is suspended.
Has anyone got a Petronius charm? I think I'm going to need one. Quickly, quickly! 